need some more female energy, don't we? So let's get Robin on. Robin Harvey, come on. Yeah. Yeah. Hello. Hello. <laughs> I'm back again. <laughs> this, is, uh, this is my uh, this is my third time here. Um, <laughs> um, uh, oh shit! I forgot my first fucking joke. This is why I shouldn't have three beers before I start. <laughs> um, I, do, I am actually dying for the loo, by the way. So this should be mercifully oh. short for all of you. Um, I'm glad you liked that one because uh, that didn't go down well at my granddad's eulogy. <laughs> oh. <laughs> um, um, yeah, so my name is Robin uh, because my parents weren't sure if they were having a boy or a girl, and they're still not. So, <laughs> uh, but names are important. They tell you a lot about someone. Like, uh, say if your name is, I don't know, like David or Daniel or Samuel, and you absolutely 100% insist that you can't be called by the short version, you're probably a bit of a prick. <laughs> like, if your response to that is, uh, actually, it's Jonathan? Well, tell me this, Jonathan, how many prostitutes do you have buried under your patio? Because you sound like a fucking sociopath. <laughs> <laughs> Someone knows one. <laughs> Um, speaking of murderers, um, I've got some, I've developed a bit of an interest lately in uh, serial killers, as a, as a topic, not as a love interest, but uh, you, can't, you can't stay single forever. Um, but I think that they've got, uh, there's, you know, there's one or two things that they can, they can teach us. I know that sounds weird, but uh, think about the, uh, the idioms that we normally use and where we get them from. You know, there's a uh, first come, first severed. <laughs> Don't put all your heads in one basket. And uh, one well, of my favourite from my boy Jeffrey Dahmer, don't bite off more than you can chew. <laughs> Sorry, that one was a little bit tasteless. <laughs> um, but the most overrated, uh, the most overrated killer, I think, uh, I think we'll all agree, he'll agree with me, is uh, Charles Manson. Like, because he never actually killed anyone. Like, we have both murdered the same amount of people. I mean, one, one more for me if you count that cry for help I ignored. <laughs> that's why I no, that's not that's not actually true. No one committed suicide. That's just the way I made it look. <laughs> um, but he's like he's like the uh, the kid in school that you did a group project with. You know, like uh, the one who'd wait till the very end and not do any work. So you know, he'd uh, he'd go go out to the library and do all the research. You know, choose all the fonts, murder Sharon Tate. Uh, and then at the end, he'd be like, put my name on it, put my name on it. Charlie, you haven't done anything. But the Manson family, it's got such a nice ring to it. Um, but I think, uh, I think I'd best move on from to uh, something almost as offensive as murder, and that's, that's fat shaming. Uh, there's been a bit in the media at the moment about fat shaming because uh, two comedians have had a bit of a spat about it. Uh, I won't tell you their names because I don't want you to think about anyone who's funnier than me. Um, I was gonna, I really wanted to sort of get into this topic and uh, you know sort of properly research it and stuff, but my local Chinese was having a, an all you can eat buffet, so. <laughs> But I, I had to go to the doctors uh, for something similar recently, and uh, I've been diagnosed as uh, as having a fantastic personality, as being uh, bubbly, hyper morbidly bubbly. <laughs> um, the reason that the reason I had to go was because I've been snoring really badly, so I thought I might have sleep apnea, and uh, I played it to him. I'd recorded it overnight, and he said, uh, "Robin, if you were my pet, I'd put you down." <laughs> and he told me all the risks of it, you know, he's like, you need to lose some weight because it can cause things like uh, you know, heart attacks, strokes, depression, impotence. I mean, if I've got one, it's not working, so you might be right. <laughs> Do you know what? I haven't written the rest of this down, <laughs> so I'm just sort of making this up on the fly now. Uh, that's why it's going so well. <laughs> um, but he, I've, uh, I have tried to make the, you know, make a lot of changes. So I'm, uh, I'm eating better. I'm exercising more. And physically, I'm feeling so much better. 
mentally, I would murder every last one of you for a slice of Domino's pizza. And I've been told that the Domino's in Hell's Owen takes that, so, uh, so there we go. I've locked all the doors, and uh, enjoy the rest of your night. No.